The Soviet T-64A was an improved variant of the T-64, featuring a 125mm smoothbore cannon and updated turret armor. To reduce the thickness of the turret, the cast aluminium filler was replaced with high-hardness steel inserts and a welded rolled homogeneous armor backing. This reduced the size of the turret while still providing an exceptional level of protection for the time. On the other hand, the MBT-70 was a highly advanced tank which never entered service, being developed during the 1960s by an American-West German joint project. While other cannons were considered, the MBT-70 was going to be armed with a 152mm gun launcher, capable of firing armor-piercing fin-stabilized discarding Sabo projectiles as well as guided missiles. Its XM578 APFSDS projectile was one of the first to utilize a tungsten alloy core, being one of the most effective projectiles for its time. 